How to create a free landing page with Canva. Hi there you guys, welcome to today's video and I'll be talking about Canva and landing page. That's a question right there because we're not sure if we can actually create a landing page using Canva, like a detailed landing page if you ask me. But uh, yeah, in order to, for us to know that, let's try to look at some of the factors that makes a landing page good or that makes a landing page functionable landing page. Now I found this article online and it says here that there are eight essential components of an effective landing page. And these are a main, including, it includes a main headline and a supporting headline. And of course, a unique selling proposition, the benefits of your offering, images or video showing context of use, social proof, a reinforcement statement, a, con a closing argument, and a call to action. Now let's look at one of those examples and let's try to identify every design element that is present in that particular page. Now we have here main headline and supporting headline. So we have here this one liner right here. We have the main headline, which is make every experience count. That's supposed to grab the visitor's attention. And next is the subheadline or supporting headline. It should be short, preferably only 10 words and never more than 20. So this should inform the visitor that about your product or about the service and what is it all about, something like that. And these are the design elements that it should have. Let's check out if the ones in Canva has that option. So let's try and type in web for this tutorial. We're going to look at if we can create a web page, sort of a look in Canva using some of the templates that are already here, because chances are Canva offers you with a lot of wide array of options with elements that you can choose from. And basically you can move around all these things and come up with your own, uh, yeah, with your own hint of personalization when it comes to that particular website. It depends on what your business is, what you do. So let's try and click on this website. Once you type in web, this will show. And you can see here the resolution and the size of the page that we're going to be working on. Let's check it out. Okay, so now let's wait for it to load up and you can see here it has around 260 templates. So now it's going to be up to you to choose some of these templates. Now let's go and look back to that example of a landing page. So it should look like this, not precisely, but make the text count. So it should be like the text should be readable. So let's look for something that highlights the text. Almost all of them has this particular trait that this site is talking about. So might as well try and skip the hullabaloo and choose one of either of these themes that are or templates that are already available. But most of them here I can see they are paid options. So now what about website and then free? I'd like to know if there are free options for this one. There you go. We found a thousand. Yeah, around a thousand of templates, but I'm not sure if they, these are actually okay website free okay all right i can see something here let's try this one i've clicked an option and apparently it's the same yeah okay all right it's the same web size but it's up to you to add more page this is more like just the template the font maybe is important here so what about let's try and create our own landing page with canva using all the the, the tools here and let's see if we can create an attractive one or basically uh, let's look at the essential factors essential components again a unique selling point let's see and um and try to implement these ideas i have here a brand name and a tagline ready so i'm just gonna go ahead and type them in right here so let's put in the brand name which is black parade right here and I'm going to put in the word code just so it looks cool. And the during quarantine, that's going to be our sub headline, right? So there is a tagline. My friend says it's keep on moving. So I'm not sure how he came up with that, but who cares? I'm <laughs> just kidding. Anyway, this is, this is actually an existing business, you guys. But I'm not sure if 
they're still active you can go ahead and check them out on facebook if you want to i told you, you can i'm not sure if you can link stuff here on canva but maybe let's go ahead and try it later on and see if it works so for the picture i think it's just right for us to change the picture right we can click on edit image right here and try to see if there's an option oh let's click on uploads and let's try to upload our own media first so basically i've already uploaded photos before so let me okay so this one is what i prefer right now okay this one let's see if it works yes it works you guys oops basically it doesn't already work the same so apparently this black part right here is part of the image let me just try and send backward if and see if it works all oh, right it's it works now let's send it backwards just like that and let me just uh, adjust the width of it right there and it looks like this look so i've already managed to overlay the branding and of course the tagline or the subheadline of the site that i'm working on and it looks like this so i'm not sure if there's a feature in each of the website generator software out there that can just easily import all of these um, edits that we're doing right now here on canva but i'm not sure we're just creating a, a type of design on some sort of a canvas using the supposed um yeah supposed sizes of a website so this is how it looks like so same goes when you try to edit the second page let's try and upload another media and for the sake of you guys of us guys looking at the differences i'm gonna just try and upload all the random stuff that's right here uh these files again these files are my friend no copyright infringement over here i'm just using um yeah i'm just using the pictures basically some of the pictures are of course pictures of me as well so it really doesn't matter so now we have to stretch this photo all the way here because it doesn't look like a real photo if it's not going to be extended i mean it's not it's not going to look like it's a part of the site if it's not going to be extended so now as you can see it looks pretty amazing you guys both of these pages for me looks amazing but the factor that we're looking for here is how to make your landing page functional over here now i'm not sure if the edit's gonna reflect over there but no it didn't now let's try and remove all of these stuff and maybe try to remove move this over here if it's that's possible nope i'm not sure but let me just go ahead and move it all right i can apparently move it and just move it right over where it's obvious and where it's visible because it's like the sub headline this one makes it pretty on point right yeah maybe put it a bit there on the hair so it looks dimensional there you go it looks quite interesting now you guys All right, so what do you think about making website on Canva? Do you think it's worth a try? Do you think you just go ahead and do it on straight ahead on a website generator? Let me know down in the comments below. And that's it for this video. See you again in the next video. Peace out.